Also, before this video starts, I want to let you guys know that this video is in collaboration with my friend Lacey. Her video will be linked down below. Her thing will be right here. She's really cool. Really cool, not cool. Go check her out. All right, on to the video. On to your programmed program. On to your pro. Good morning. <laughs> Normally, I clean in the mornings. At night, I know a lot of people like to clean at night time, but like I have no energy at night. Like after I eat dinner, after like seven o'clock, I'm done. So I go to bed with a dirty house and I wake up to a dirty house and then I clean that dirty house just to go to bed with a dirty house. <laughs> I gotta get breakfast. I think we're gonna do brunch. So I'm gonna let the kids have something to snack uh, on. And while I get it tidied up in here and then I'll do a big brunch for them so like an early lunch then we gotta tackle school so this is what my day looks like I wake up groggy I clean groggy cuz I found out that if I clean while I'm sleepy I forget what it feels like to clean so I don't dread it as much and then and then after I'm done cleaning a while I wake up that dopamine is it dopamine or is that a drug something gets me going adrenaline it gets me going and then I'm awake until like seven. So I'm really only awake seven hours of a day. <laughs> Cause at seven o'clock I'm crashing again and I'm like binging lost and doing nothing. Let's get it done, get her done. But I don't wanna get her done, but I have to get her done. <laughs> Distraction number one. I gotta roll up my breeches because there's snow on the ground. Oh, this is a flattering angle. Hello, snatched waist. Okay. <laughs> I got Colton shoes on, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> See, I know where those don't fit. I got a toe in them. I'm not recording. Yeah, you're recording. This better be recorded. I ain't doing this toss. She's talking. 
talking to she's talking to invisible people behind the camera. They're in the camera. What? <laughs> you're invisible. Like, oh, you're in our house and you're invisible. <laughs> All right, y'all ready, chores? Okay, so I got that load of laundry put up. I got the table wiped down. I really need to fix this breakfast, well, brunch, well, lunch, because it's like 12 o'clock. So I'm gonna see if I have any clean dishes enough to do that. I'm not making any promises. Um, I, we'll see what we can work with. What the heck you doing? What are you doing? Look, a replacement for Blendy. What should we name this one? We'll name this one Mindy the Mixer, since Blendy the Blender was never actually a blender. Um, this one's Mindy the Mixer. Let's see how long you. Welcome to the Hunger Games. <laughs> since I'm working with minimal dishes, I'm just going to preheat the oven first. Make some quick strawberry muffins. Gourmet homemade. I wonder if buttermilk would take skin that. I'm not doing buttermilk, but I'm just, I'm wondering. My spoon's warped. <laughs> it's like a, it's like a ladle. A ladle, 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 ladle. Every time I say ladle, I think of Patrick and SpongeBob when he goes, ladle, 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 ladle. Chicken wing, chicken wing, hot dog and bologna, chicken and macaroni. Chicken wing. Oh no, 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 do, 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 do. Don't do that. Don't do that to me. Dag nabbit. The overfilled muffins, the messed up halfway filled muffins, the mini muffins, and the invisible muffin. Here's the state of my pitiful. Um, this one, bless its heart. It's just. It's different. <laughs> it's so funny though, because like, I feel like we're adults, but we're still in that high school mentality because like nowadays it's, you eat your muffins out of a bag. Like you can make homemade in just a short amount of time. And it's like, I remember vaguely somebody saying, you wear Walmart, Abercrombie has sales all the time. Like, it's literally the same thing. You can't convince me it's not the same thing. I haven't eaten anything this morning. Um, my kids have snacked around on raisins and like snacky like fruit and stuff like that. Cause it's literally, this was supposed to be brunch and I was gonna make a much larger brunch, um, but this is lunch. <laughs> They've already snacked on raisins, on fruit. I have not eaten anything as of right now, 12 o'clock. And y'all ask how I'm obese. I don't know, you tell me, cause I don't eat nothing. Genetic sucks. I'm gonna drink it with my milk, not chocolate milk, because we don't do chocolate milk in the mornings. We do chocolate milk in the afternoons. It's just milk in the mornings. I was gonna sit here and do like a little Q and A with you guys, but also I wanna save that for a video. I do wanna mention though, a lot of people have wondered like why, ah, did y'all hear that? It sounded like a dang dinosaur. Hey! <laughs> um, a lot of y'all have asked me why I don't show my bedroom very often. I have a few videos where I've shown it and the kids' room and the bathrooms um, and the laundry room. I do show the laundry room a little bit. I have shown all the other rooms before. But the reason I haven't as of lately is because I am actually doing something that I think you guys are gonna love. I'm filming um, remodels on those areas. 
and it's taken some time it's taken quite a bit of time because there's quite a bit of rooms but I don't want to show you guys any sneak peeks so that's why you hardly ever hear as of lately see my bedroom laundry room or the kids room or the other bathroom um, but soon very 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 soon you will get remodel videos so soon you're gonna have you're gonna have mobile home updates videos and I've been talking and been staring at this and I just want to take a bite hold on sorry I I'm hungry I'm excited because I worked really hard <laughs> and try to keep it a secret is that better milk or is that clabber milk I think it's that better. go check the date on that JJ Watching this on uh, uh, top L. Top L. It's where whoever uh, wins to be on Santa's list uh, gets to be in the next episode, and they call celebrity guests. Celebrity guests. <laughs> um, he's doing that. I just took a break with everything because I saw where Chelsea from a recipe land. She posted, and y'all, I love her. Y'all, I rarely, I rarely, if ever miss one of her uploads if your day ain't going the way that you want it to watch chelsea from a Bay land she makes me get up and be like yo i can do this <laughs> i can make it through this day so now i have to lay out the chicken for dinner because i forgot to and it's like oh snap where you at chicken where you at it's it's like one o'clock <laughs> so i've got to thaw this out and then get some laundry done and then hopefully oh i got dishes to do do a load of dishes and start school is that is this how today is is this is this okay it's gonna be that day huh <laughs> but speaking on what i was just talking about there are a lot of different youtubers that i go to for a lot of different things um if i'm needing mom encouragement pick me up i go to chelsea or jam morrell um, Jen Morrell's Family Table, I believe it is, and Arispe Land. I've been watching Jen Morrell for as long as she's been on YouTube, um, which is a long time. Chelsea, I've been watching for a few months. Um, I go to them for encouragement. If I'm needing cleaning motivation, I go to Carrie uh, from Carrie Lynn. Um, I go to Candace Calora. I go to, um, gosh, there's so, there's so many. And if I'm needing like a connection, like with my actual friend, like like if I just need to sit down and feel like I'm just with a friend, um, then I go to I go to Chaotic Country. Um, Tony over there, we are very good friends, and I can just go watch her video and feel like I'm just talking with someone, even though I'm not doing any of the talking and she's doing all the talking. I still feel that way. For food, I go to you know Taylor from Taylor Elmore. There's just so many people. I couldn't even begin, couldn't even begin to uh, tell y'all like who all I watch. I watch a lot of people. Don't ask me how I had the time to. Well, my house pays the price for it, but. You know what? I'll leave. I'll leave channels linked down below um, for like categories, like who I go to watch for encouragement, who I go to watch for motivation, who I go to watch for connection, who I go to watch for food, who I go to watch to get ideas, um, inspiration, all that stuff. I'll leave that down below. That'd be fun. Enough talking to y'all though. Y'all are a distraction. I gotta get this laundry done.
cakes. But we're gonna add some of these babies in there too. come back and come back for more. It's got to be diabetic coma level sweet. So while my girls are finishing up their school, um, they're doing their independent work now that they, like the work that they can do by themselves. Um, sometimes, uh, y'all tell me all the time that you want like a homeschool day in the life and stuff, but ours is so different. Like sometimes we sit down at the table, sometimes we don't. Sometimes I homeschool them all, like as a whole, um, for five hours a day. Sometimes I do one child here, one child here, one child here. Depending on if I'm seeing that they're not excelling in a certain area or maybe even falling behind in a certain area and they need like personal one-on-one -on -one time. Um, right now I'm doing the girls uh, as a whole and then after they get done with their independent work, I'll start Colton school because here lately, you get them together and they just bounce off one another and they don't want to listen and the energy is just really high and, and they have my like brain. <laughs> all four of my kids have my brain. <laughs> um, they, they're everywhere all the time and I can't blame them for being that way and I can sympathize and empathize with them for being that way because I'm that way too. So if I can't expect myself to sit there for four hours and do book work, how in the world can I expect a mini, much younger, much more emotional person being to do that. So we do whatever works with us while staying in our Tennessee guidelines, our Tennessee state codes, um, which are pretty, they're not too bad. They're they are not super relaxed, but they're, they're not too bad. They are required four hours of school a day. So regardless of how we get that school done, has to be four hours of school a day. So all that to say, it is 3.56 and the girls are just now finishing up. Colton's about to get rolling on his. Most of Colton's work he can do by himself. He is 10 years old. Um, we don't do grades in this house. I don't say he's a third grader, he's a fourth grader, he's a fifth grader. He's 10 years old. I know the level he's on, that's all that matters. Um, I don't want to put the pressure on him to be a certain way. Um, because he's never been in school. So he doesn't know that like they, they put you on a level. He doesn't know he's never been put on a level. We just know where he's at. So, does that make sense? <laughs> so, anyway, does it baby?
think that's a few minutes behind. It's actually almost 5 30. Um, I'm going to make Shay just go home. Say hi, Shay. Yo, what's up? Welcome to MTV Crib. He just got home from work, so I'm gonna make this chicken and stuffing bake. I started out by preparing this chicken stuffing mix just the way the box tells me to. I tried my best to follow directions. I know some of y'all think that it's not possible for me to follow directions, but it is. When I want to, it's just a matter of wanting to for me. Um, but I just did that first. After the chicken is done cooking, you want to add an onion. I just had this purple onion here, so I used it. Um, but I guess yellow would work, blue would work, green would work, I don't know. Well, no, green onions are bad, I think. Oh, no, definitely don't do green onions. But then I just added a can of green beans, and I have cooked this covered until the vegetables are softened. Um, and now I've got to add a fourth a cup of flour. Shane hates cream of mushroom. He literally gags at the even mention of it. So I have to always be sneaky when I add this into my food. As long as he doesn't know it's there, it doesn't bother him. So I have to be super sneaky. He was trying to get y'all to tell him what I was doing because he saw my eyes. I was cutting my eyes at him like he knows when I'm doing something. <laughs> I added half of a block of cream cheese to it. I just cubed it up and put it in there. And once that melted, I put it into my prepared pan and topped it with the chicken and stuffing mix and cooked it on 400 for 30 minutes. Look who's helping me with dishes. This is your Christmas present. Christmas present. <laughs> my Christmas present. check out my friend's video tomorrow's video is a bake and clean with me so be sure to keep an eye out for that 7 p.m eastern standard time i hope you all have a blessed morning evening night whatever it is wherever you're at Whew. i'm ready for bed y'all ready for bed i'm ready for bed